Alright, so here is my second attempt at 21.3 uh, slash 0.4. Uh, first off the bat, uh, you'll notice that uh, I actually started the workout correctly. Um, so you're supposed to uh, start under the pull-up bar and then uh, once the clock gets to zero, uh, make your way to the barbell. Um, I only just read that uh, today or just before I did the workout. Um, completely missed that um, and if I was only doing that once that would have been a big mistake because I would have got penalized uh, for not starting correctly um, and then during the break um, you will need to start behind the line again so I uh, managed to tick that one off so um, all good in regards to uh, doing it correctly for one uh, when it comes to strategy um, I actually changed it slightly um, for what I, what I was talking about in the last video uh, in the last video I was talking about um, doing uh, the thrusters in two sets uh, this time around after watching it through again um, and just trying to work out what happened um, the, what made the wheels fall off so dramatically uh, I decided to do uh, three sets on the thrusters and that was simply just to again try and keep that heart rate at a little bit more uh, comfortable levels um, so I can actually um, do more reps so the strategy is to go slower to do more reps which uh, sounds sort of a bit strange um, but yeah that, that, that's the strategy just go slower and uh, get more reps uh, in regards to front squats, toes to bar and chest to bar pull ups, they remained the same. So I was doing uh, the front squats unbroken, the toes to bar and chest to bar pull ups in three sets, uh, 12, 10, 8. And then uh, with the thrusters, like I said, this time around, I did three sets, so three sets of five. And then uh, my plan on the muscles was to do um, sets of three for as long as I can and then sets of two and then hopefully uh, won't have to go into singles but um, that was a strategy that was a plan um, and to my intention was obviously to finish the workout uh, which I believe I am uh, doing not quite there yet but definitely capable of finishing the bar muscle ups at least um, so that's where we're at with that one so in regards to um, how much slower I was planning on going um, I was thinking uh, I was planning on about one minute uh, give or take a few seconds um, so I believe on my first attempt I finished the front squats at about the 10 minute mark so I had about five minutes to do the bar muscle ups. Uh, so I was thinking even if I um, get to the bar muscle ups at 11 minutes, it's still enough time to complete uh, 30 reps. Um, that was my thinking and the reason I um, slowed it down. So that my heart rate was gonna be a little bit more manageable and I was able to do bigger sets and more reps uh, first attempts, I got uh, 13 uh, bar muscle ups out of the 30, which I was and still not uh, happy with. Um, I just, I, I, again, I know I did the thrusters and stuff unbroken, but um, I was super surprised um, on how high my heart rate was and how uncomfortable I was. Uh, just completely threw me off uh, and yeah just just couldn't get comfortable um, so this time around like I mentioned it was all about just slowing everything down um, making sure I could manage that heart rate so even on the front squats I took a little bit slower uh, in between my sets on the toes to bar and the chest to bar pull-ups I was uh, chalking up in between uh, and that was simply not because I needed chalk, it was to uh, force myself to rest a little bit longer um, just to make sure 
because I was sort of arguing with myself, or not arguing, talking with myself, you know, because usually it's, you know, get back on the bar faster, pick it up now. Um, this time around it was the complete opposite. It was okay, you know, just take your time, and then obviously not too long, but um, keep your composure, keep your heart rate down. Um, so it was a little bit different to what I uh, normally train, um, but um, I believed it was going to pay off in the end because when I got to the uh, bar muscle ups on the first attempt I was in <laughs> no state to uh, do what I wanted to do or do what I needed to do so um, I felt that this was definitely the right strategy for me so going into um, well, on my uh, minute rest for the um, second attempt I believe I don't know, on the pull-ups um, the, pull, uh, the chest bar felt uh, actually better than the uh, first time around um, on the first set uh, sorry first attempt um, the, the eights felt um, a little bit harder than I would have liked uh, however this time around they felt pretty comfortable uh, my heart rate felt a little bit higher than I was expecting on the second time around but still much more manageable um, and then obviously doing the three sets of five on the thrusters uh, helped as well um, I was felt like um, I kept it fairly consistent with the rest on the thrusters between five to eight seconds um, and you see here on the chest of our pull-ups um, I would it took a little bit longer uh, that was deliberate um, just so I wouldn't take too long on the uh, thrusters because I felt I had a little bit more control uh, during the gymnastics portion rather than the uh, the barbell movement um, so it took a little bit longer uh, so there I uh, actually tore my hand um, no blood or anything just uh, skin came off so fix that up and then back to the bar uh, to do my first set uh, with the uh, three sets of five it did feel uh, a little bit overkill um, I felt I probably could have done uh, two sets but uh, having said that I'm pretty happy with the strategy that I with the three sets of five because um, it allowed me to uh, be a little bit more control during the um, uh, bar muscle ups um, it did feel strange just doing sets of five um, but it worked um, so can't really complain too much just more the fact that it felt uh, a little bit uh, odd just doing five reps but hey it's what I had to do um, my fitness level is not where I need it to be so this is what I need to improve my score um, and you'll be able to tell uh, so my split time for the first attempt was 7.44 I believe or 7.45 or something like that um, and my split time for the second attempt was uh, 8.49 I believe <clears throat> so just over a minute um, which is exactly where I wanted it to be uh, so I managed to keep a uh, fairly good time uh, Managed my time well in regards to the rest and the reps, so I was quite happy with that. Um, so it gave me a lot of confidence uh, going into the final round here. Whereas you can tell on my first attempt, um, I broke up the front squats um, and was just resting. I don't actually remember what time I got to the bar muscle ups on my second attempt, so it's going to be interesting to see. Uh, on the first attempt, it was roughly about uh, all around the 10 minute mark. Um, so it'll be interesting to see exactly how much time I had on the second attempt. again on the uh, second attempt I get back to the bar at the 9.49 which is now uh, complete my set of 15 
So on my first attempt, I know, it was just after 10 minutes and had our five more reps left I think on the uh, set of front squats. So it must have been about 10.30 or around there, close to it at least. Um, definitely felt a lot better. Um, the strategy of slowing down definitely uh, works for me. Um, my uh, fitness level is at so 10.21 is where I finished the first attempt but don't actually do a bar muscle up until I don't even know when to be honest um, I should have gone straight into it so that's a set of 15 so I wonder if I uh, do a bar muscle up first on my second attempt So again, on my second attempt, just taking my time, making sure. Um, I definitely felt a lot better, um, as you can tell. Uh, still requiring a little bit of rest. So I do manage to get on the bar at 11.06 on the first attempt, but only get one rep. For my second attempt, um, just after the first one, um, but managed to do uh, three reps. So feeling a lot better. Um, bar muscle ups I'm fairly comfortable with, usually. Um, obviously I struggle with a higher heart rate clearly um, again that's just something I'm going to have to work on throughout this uh, next year um, but that felt pretty good I uh, didn't want to do more than three uh, just because I felt I could uh, continue to do threes for longer rather than sort of doing four or five reps and uh, having to have more rest um, so I end up doing uh, another set of three on the second second go, and then uh, I believe I do uh, three sets of three to start with, uh, which is not too bad. Far more than I did um, on my first attempt. So yeah, um, strategy clearly worked. Um, I was able to do uh, more reps, bigger sets. Um, I feel I'm, I'm, I still believe I can finish the uh, bar muscle ups um, if I was to uh, do it again. Um, but don't get me wrong, I was still uh, very happy to um, increase my uh, score um, for the workout. Um, it was, I, again, I was so um, surprised by the workout the first attempt. Um, I don't know whether I didn't think about it enough or just the strategy was completely wrong um, but it sort of threw me a little bit um, so it was good to um, show that I'm uh, capable of doing uh, better um, so which is good so I end up doing uh, like I said three sets of uh, three and then uh, sets of two after that um, so with 90 seconds to go I think I've done uh, 13 or 15 reps or something like that. Um, so still taking quite a bit of rest in between uh, each set, but just far less. And I'm, like I said, I'm able to string more together. So 60 seconds to go. I'm pretty sure uh, up to that point I was up to 17. Uh, so that would mean 19. So it's uh, 21 reps. Oh, actually, I think that was uh, 19 reps. Yeah, I do two here, so it's 20, 21 reps there. Uh, and then with uh, 10 seconds to go, uh, squeeze in one more rep. 
So I end up with a score of uh, 157, I think, which is 22 bar muscle ups. And then uh, going into the lifts here, um, same sort of strategy. Uh, even though I felt more confident uh, going into it, well, on the first attempt, I didn't even realize that I had the lift. I completely forgot about it. Um, but felt a lot more confident. I just hadn't done the work to be able to lift uh, much more weight than I did in the first attempt. Um, so I wasn't stressed about it. Um, you know, I sort of accepted that this uh, score is going to be quite low, or this, this total is going to be quite low. Um, so I end up, I think I end up with uh, 85 kilo, uh, which is, um, I think I did 85.5, uh, which works out to be like 188.1. So I've got a score of 188 pounds, um, which again isn't fantastic or even good. Um, it's not absolutely terrible but um, it's not, not far off what I would imagine uh, for me um, in the past I've done similar complexes just to give you an idea um, where I've hit um, you know, between 90 and 95 kilo uh, which is again still not fantastically awesome I'm not the the strongest person or most powerful um, and Olympic lifting you know, is something that I've always been okay at um, but never never fantastic so again uh, quite content with uh, how I went on the lifts um, whilst under fatigue you know, they're not pretty or anything like that but again nothing terrible nothing that's going to cause injury um, but just sort of got it done and left it there so in regards to uh, the open itself uh, and my performance uh, going into it I had a goal of finishing in the top 10% it um, doesn't look like I'm going to uh, achieve that um, I am sitting currently at uh, 11.50 on Monday morning uh, currently sitting in 110th position uh, clearly there's still a, a truckload of people that haven't entered their score, so all the top top guys. Um, so I believe I need to stay under 186, I think it is, um, to qualify for the uh, that top 10%. I think. Um, that's just going off the top of my head. I don't really remember, to be honest. I don't even know how many people uh, entered. Um, but doesn't look like I am going to uh, make that top 10% which is um, disappointing but not really surprising uh, I just hadn't done enough work to uh, push myself into that top 10% um, which means that it's back to uh, training um, and really trying to get a full year in of training would be nice um, really work on those weaknesses um, whilst keep working on the strengths making them strengths um, I sort of what would normally be my strengths had slipped a little bit uh, movements, things like pull-ups and toes to bar and um, uh, bar muscle ups and muscle ups um, again have in the past have been a uh, strength of mine um, but I uh, just hadn't done the work to maintain that so they slipped behind and then my weaknesses became even more of a weakness um, so things like my uh, cardiovascular endurance and strength work um, is definitely something that I'm going to be focusing on over this next year um, so basically back to the drawing board which again is somewhat disappointing but not, not super surprising um, Obviously, the guys ahead of me are just uh, fitter than what I am, fitter, stronger, faster, um, which is fine. They've obviously put in putting in the work, um, and I have not. So, back to the drawing board, back to training, and uh, I actually am looking forward to it, um, putting in the hard work. So, we'll uh, leave it there, watch the uh, rest, and then we'll uh, catch you on the next video.